we are here to express why the BBC is not reporting the human rights abuses going up in Uganda. Ugandans in the UK, joined by anti-corruption activists, pro-democracy and human rights campaigners, staged a peaceful protest at the Uganda High Commission in London, urging the international community to hold President Museveni accountable for the ongoing human rights abuses, corruption, and political repression. The protesters specifically called for international sanctions against President Museveni's son, Muhuzi Kainarugaba, who also serves as the chief of defense forces. They demanded an end to the trial of political prisoners at the general court-martial and their unconditional release. This protest is not an isolated incident, as Uganda has faced criticism for its human rights record. Recently, the U.S. imposed sanctions on a former Ugandan military commander, Peter Elwelu, for gross human rights violations and extrajudicial killings. Additionally, Human Rights Watch has reported on the Ugandan authorities' crackdown on activists, opposition members, and human rights defenders. The following are their key demands. They want President Museveni held accountable for human rights abuses, corruption, and political repression. They want international sanctions on Muhuzi Kainarugaba, President Museveni's son, and the Chief of Defense Forces. They want unconditional release of all political prisoners and an end to their trial at the general court-martial. The protest at Uganda House in London highlights the growing concern among Ugandans and international human rights advocates about the country's deteriorating human rights situation. But journalists in Uganda have been tortured and the BBC is quiet. Journalists in Uganda are being murdered and the BBC is quiet. The war in Congo is going on as we speak, but BBC has never covered it because they are supporting the brutal dictator Museven who has invaded Eastern Congo and the BBC has not reported it on the international media. It's gone quiet like business as normal, but we know the reason why. They have betrayed the name BBC. BBC is being funded by the UK taxpayer, including myself and yourself. But so sad to see that the UK taxpayer's money goes to support a brutal dictator of seven. A dictator who has completely silenced the journalists in Uganda. Buy another house now. We are here to express why the BBC is not reporting the human rights abuses going up in Uganda. They were quick to go to Ethiopia when the children decided to fight the government in Ethiopia. The BBC was there. Because who was found in the children in Ethiopia? Dictator Seven. Dictator Seven was the only found in the children in Ethiopia. And the BBC were on the ground. But when Museven invades Eastern Congo in the name of chasing ADF, we can't see BBC reporting that. Because they're in the focus of the brutal dictator Seven. We know we have two BBC. The BBC, which reports Europe and Asia, that's a different BBC. And then we've got the BBC, which is compromised, which is supposed to be reporting about Africa. That is dead. That is the two BBC we have. We have the fair BBC, which reports about Europe and Asia, and then we have a second BBC which reports for Africa, whereby before anything goes out in the air is sanctioned by the, by the dictator seven. 
The dictator Museven is a brutal murderer. The brutal Museven he has brutalized Ugandans for 37 good years. Why the BBC should be supporting such a brutal dictator? Why the BBC is not reporting that women in Uganda are being raped? Why the BBC is not reporting the war in Eastern Congo? Because they are involved with the dictator in raping the mineral resources of DRC. That has never been mentioned. We know the director of BBC. He talks to the General Museven. We know the director of BBC. He speaks to the General Dictator Museven in Uganda. Are you tired of dirty laundry piling up? Look no farther than Fuller's Laundry Chirinha. Our expert staff use eco-friendly detergents to wash, dry, and fold your clothes with care. From dry cleaning to alterations, we've got you covered. We offer pickup and delivery services for your convenience. Call or WhatsApp us today on 0789-327937 or 0753-355817. Fuller's Laundry Chirinha. Cleaning your clothes, clearing your mind. Ooh la la.